a segment called yes and no. Okay. So I'm going to throw out a few uh, statements at you. Okay. And you just, I don't need an explanation. Okay. If I want an explanation, I'll ask. Okay. But just the answer is yes or no. Chala. Have you ever been arrested? No. How boring. I know. Even I haven't. Uh, <laughs> do you believe in aliens? I, yes. Good. I do. Good. I'm I glad because I do too. <laughs> do you enjoy cooking? No. Great. Are you afraid of heights? No. Uh, lied about why you're declining a project? No. If you were given a chance, choose a completely different career path. I would have been a vet. A vet? Ah, I could see that since you love animals. Or a zookeeper, I'm, you know, something I would not around. be a zookeeper. In fact, if I was, if I had that and like I had that power, I would actually like... I would have, have actually been like working for National Geographic. I was, I just sucked in biology so much, sucked in sciences. Why was I into all of these sports and everything? Because I sucked in school. You, but you know, that's like, <laughs> see, that's the problem here. Like yeah. I, before I wrap up, I'm just going to make this point because here, like and with the schooling system and with the education system, if your potential is only yeah. marked on what you are being taught. Yes, right? yes. Each individual is different. You're like, I think I flourished more out of high school and college. Me when too. When the entire yes. paradigm of like education changed. Yeah. Education changed. Uh, that is when I started, I became an A grade student yeah. because I was doing what I wanted to do. Yeah. And then I started excelling more in life. Like just generally because I was like, my different parts, facets of my personality that were being yeah. shut down in school under the under the banner of discipline. Yeah. Kind yeah. of like there's like there's no yeah. requirement for this. Huh. So I, I feel you on that. That I mean that yes, that if you're out there and you're different, guys, like own your individuality because please, you know what? Please. In high school you might not be the shining star, but you know what, when you come out into the open world, like into like the real world, you'll shine. And that's something that I think a lot of people huh. And stop idealizing people based on how they look. Please, please. I mean, you can't look like them. You can't. So stop saying that, oh, I want that bod. I want that nose. I want that. You can't have it. You really have to accept what you have. You have. 